David Sheehan is with us tonight to talk about a movie that has people passing out in the lobby on their way in or on their way out, David. Well, you've heard about all those reports about The Exorcist and uh, the trouble it's causing, people fainting and so forth. I went to check it out. The manager of the National Theater in Westwood says that there indeed are at least a dozen people who faint or become ill during every showing. We have a lot of people throwing up and a lot of people shuddering. But the thing that really surprises me is people faint. I mean, I've never in my life known a movie where people would faint. I mean, it's hard to make people faint. I have a friend in there alone, and I, I, I don't want to leave her in there alone. I'm not standing here shaking for nothing. <laughs> How about you? Oh, it's very, very real. I don't like it. I want to go home. Time out, because if you've got the strength and the will to do all that, you're about to get beat down. You're gonna... These scenes give so much in such a short amount of time. There's just so much we need to talk about. I don't even I don't even have the words for all that just happened in that scene. I don't have the words. I'm just waiting for Indiana Jones to pop out. Right? That's what I'm thinking as well. Like, what's going on? <laughs> the Exorcist is a horror film. This doesn't look horrifying. I mean, it's physical labor. I'm going to be scared the most. Dude, just looking at physical labor makes me scared. <laughs> Whoa, that was a good jump. It really was. Holy shoot. No, he's not getting work done with that thing. Who's this old guy? Oh, he's not doing too well, this guy. Nah, man, he doesn't look like he should be there. He looks like he's struggling. <laughs> he really doesn't look like he should be there. Like, you saw that kid running, and him, he's struggling just to get out of that little hole. Spooky dark hole. Dude, don't put your hand in there. Come on. Oh, no. Okay, that's a better idea. Put that's the axe smart. inside. That was really smart. Okay, he can barely use it. Oh, my God. <laughs> what is he doing? Wait, he did all There's that? There's like no effort when he... What's that? Oh, he knows. Why is he look okay? Wait, what? He's opening it? Oh no, it's just that. Looks like a demon or something. What is that? Dude, that was cool! I want one of those. <laughs> Oh, he's not doing too hot. Oh. Oh. Wait, is he okay? No. He just broke a cursed artifact. 
in their country, and now he's about to leave. He looks so unsettled. Oh. See, he's already cursed. Bad luck. He hasn't even made it out of the country yet. Uh oh. Oh, he's cool. He's cool. Oh. Yeah. He's cursed. He is unleashed an unspeakable evil. Is he just feeling called to evil? Georgetown? Excuse me? What in the world is that noise? Oh, you know, if you're looking up there and assuming it's coming from there, then you should just not. A raccoon, maybe, that snuck in. Sure do love you. No. What is the music? <laughs> Halloween! Okay, nothing particularly too scary has happened yet, which is nice. Nothing too scary has happened yet. We're in a good space. Father, could you help an old altar boy? What? What? There. <laughs> <laughs> hey, where'd this come from? Oh, no. Where? <laughs> Closet. Couldn't be me. I literally would not. Oh, yeah. Well, let's both play. <laughs> you really don't want me to play, huh? No, I do. Captain Howdy said no. Captain, Captain Howdy? Captain Howdy, that isn't very nice. Well, maybe he's sleeping. You think? Dinner at the White House. Oh. Was there a big party or something? Yeah, it's five or six feet. Wow, that's a big thing. <laughs> oh, Mom, can't we get a horse? Well, no, <laughs> we're in Washington. I know, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see when we get home, okay? I already know my answer. If I would ever ask for a horse when a kid. <laughs> my plushy toys could be the horses because there was absolutely no money where to get a horse. <laughs> oh my God, this... Oh my god. This place looks horrible. You live here? Is there any particular reason why you live in this place? I don't know in the US, but usually the priests and people from churches that live in Spain or in most European countries, they are pretty rich. I'm surprised. Oh, that's my cat. Your uncle John passed by to visit me. Oh, oh really? When? Well, huh? I'd like to take you somewhere where you'd be safe, you wouldn't be alone. So she's the one who lives here. This is my house, and I'm not going no place. I know how difficult is that. I also have to deal with similar similar conditions. Tell me, what is the matter? Oh, that he would love to be next to you. He worries about you. He doesn't know how to keep you safe and closer to him. Oh, I don't like needles. Oh, I don't like this. Oh. Perfectly still, breathe normally. <laughs> Look at the nurse's little hat. <laughs> oh, shit. What was that? Oh, no. Okay, so that's not Reagan anymore. It's Captain Howdy. The condition isn't quite what it seems. Nobody knows the cause of hyperkinetic behavior in the child. The Ritalin seems to work to relieve... So they're saying that she has ADHD? Specifically, Mrs. McNeil. She advised me to keep my fingers away from her. Try not to worry. No! Worry! Captain Howdy is a cute name for a demon. <laughs> I, I don't like that name, it just juxtaposes what you think. Yeah. I just imagine at the end when she's possessed. My name is Captain Howdy. <laughs> <laughs> we never know. I think I've lost my faith, Tom. Yeah. Alright, 
Karen. <laughs> <laughs> You've got to shiver for some Kept reason. Can't tell me she's going up there. <laughs> <sighs> no, don't. Not with the mannequins. <gasps> oh, Carl. <sighs> wow. <laughs> Who the hell did that? Jeez. That is the woman. Yeah. Couldn't you put us someplace else? Like what? Private hospital? Who got the money for that, Dimi? You? I mean, who's the priest I keep seeing there? He's there all the time. He's black hair and he's very intense looking. Damien Karras. He had a pretty rough knock last night, poor guy. His mother passed away. She was living by herself and I guess she was dead a couple of days before they found her. I'm so confused. It's very jumpy in, in terms of time gone. Yeah, yeah, isn't it's it? A bit, that's why I'm a bit weird, isn't it? Is it? That's why I'm kind of finding it hard to keep track of what's actually going on. What? My idea of heaven is a solid white nightclub with me as the headliner for all eternity. Love me. It's kind of a selfish view. Fuck that. I don't want to be in that heaven. <laughs> yeah, no, me either. <laughs> oh, shit. The, the demon spawns awoken. Hello. <laughs> Hello, priest. I'm gonna die up there. What? Huh? Oh. 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 Again? You gotta take her outside. <laughs> Did you not walk her before she went to bed? <laughs> it's fucked. Uh-oh. Are they, is that the rats? <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you in the bed with her? Get, Get her out of the bed. Go. Been there, I wasn't there, I should have been there. There was nothing you could do. But so I think he brought her home and then she died. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Make sure your bed's not on Vibri, my guy. We just watch what happens when you yeah. forget to turn that shit off. Oh. What? Um. That's, that's, his, mo that's his mom? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, right? Oh, is he having a dream? Do you think this is the... Oh, fuck! Nosferatu popped up again. Holy shit. Oh, that's... Dude, these dreams are the worst, bro. We can never catch up to whatever you're trying to get after. Stop. Stop this nightmare, please. I don't want it! You fucking bastard! It's the nerves, huh? The type of disturbance in the chemical electrical activity of the brain. Bro. Daughter in the temporal lobe. It's up here in the lateral part of the brain. I got on the bed. The whole bed was Exactly. And... How can that be caused by some electrical imbalance in your brain? Daughter is not her bed. It's her brain. He has no idea what he's talking about. That was a queen-sized bed that was shaking. Lesion in the temporal lobe. I really don't understand how her whole personality could change. Exactly. If it's a lesion in the way she's fortunate, all we have to do is remove the scar. Remove what? A part of her brain? Oh, man. I would definitely have taken a second opinion before doing all this shit. Oh my god, she does not look good. Her lips are blue. She looks like she isn't getting enough oxygen into her body or something. This is so... Oh my god. Talk about true horror. <gasps> Jesus. Oh, Is this all necessary? Oh my god. Jesus. 
There was a bug that flew at my face. I got scared. <laughs> this is all just so extra and looks more painful than a, than a possession. What is that noise? What was that? A biopsy or something? Oof, that looks so painful. I'm guessing it's nothing. Yeah, there's nothing there. What's happening? Well, that was Ritalin. Your Ritalin is not gonna help her, bro. Please, man, make it stop! It's burning! We'll make it stop! It's hit! Bro! <laughs> oh my god. Why is her neck like a frog? <laughs> Keep away! The sour is mine! Fuck me! Oh my god. This is. Oh, this is a lot. This is a lot. This is a lot. Oh my god, this is so much. I never thought, I never, ever thought I would hear a fucking, what, 12 year old say that. Oh, oh my god. What the fuck? I'm like frozen right now. Jesus Christ! Oh God! Oh, oh yeah. God! Oh fuck! I hate seeing that shit. Fuck me! Fuck me! What? Fuck me! Oh yeah! Fuck! Did you see the handprint just formed on her face? Oh my God! Yeah, like, what do you fucking say? Yeah, <laughs> God, I'm like, normally I'm much more, like, energetic and yelling, but I'm, like, frozen, you know what I'm saying? But the shit she was saying, man. Yeah. Literally lifting her down and saying that kind of shit? Yeah. Like, it's actually disturbing. We still think it's the temporal lobe. Oh, you, st you still think that? Oh, you fucking think it's the temporal lobe? <laughs> man, that poor mom, like, I feel so sorry for her. Too bad for her. Yeah, shit. That would actually help you right now. <laughs> Some presence in there. Oh, God. Dude, I would not want to go to my daughter's room again. <laughs> yeah, no, just just let her sleep. <laughs> what the hell do you mean going up and living right by yourself? Are you crazy? Your windows wide open. Oh, what did he tell you? Didn't tell you that? Fucking Burke. So he left? Yeah, I guess so. Bag of shit. Oh. Fuck, okay. Oh, was he that guy at the drunk at the party? Oh, maybe, yeah. I never, I didn't put that together. Are you comfortable, Ray? I want to look away from this shot. I know. <laughs> oh, I hate, I hate where her hand is. Oh God. Oh I God. I'm speaking to the person inside right now. Oh God. You were there. You too had your concerns. So oh, so they're doing hypnotherapy. Yeah. Okay. Got it. Okay. <laughs> oh, 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 holy shit! Did you just grab his dick? Yeah! Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, the window was open in the beginning. Remember, like, in the beginning, she entered her daughter's room and the window was already open. Was it... The first time that the demon came in, maybe? Okay, so if the demon either comes from outside, which makes sense, right? But if if the Are window is a, a sign of something what else, does that mean the maybe the demon so doesn't like heat and, oh. and only likes cold? I think I remember something about that. That's probably just a memory of the movie. Perk's dead. He must have been drunk. He fell down from the top of the steps right outside. By the time he hit M Street, he broke his neck. Who broke his neck? What? Uh. You comfortable, Reagan? Yes. Yeah, you look comfortable. <laughs> Is there someone inside you? Yes. Sometimes. Oh, so he goes away sometimes? He doesn't stay. I'm speaking to the person inside of Reagan now. Come forward. Answer me now. Nope. Nope. Does she have more than one kid? It's not too late to have more kids. Oh. Damn! Of course there is one out 
outside chance for a cure. You ever heard of exorcism? <laughs> You're telling me that I should take my daughter to a witch doctor? Yeah. Is that it? Yeah. Girl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> she just punched that guy in the bits. Oh, that was a cool shot to like follow him down. Oh my god. Well, I think that ends today's session. Yeah, and they said she was only 12? That's crazy. I thought she was like a teenager at least, but if she just turned 12, oh my gosh, that's so young. Did she look like a boxer? I haven't seen Rocky. The bottom of those steps leading to M Street with his head turned completely around. Oh, God. That's so scary. Oh. No. Why? You ever heard of exorcism? Hello. That's almost the name of the movie. The rabbi or the priest try to drive out this so-called invading spirit. I'm surprised they're even suggesting this. Exorcism can make it disappear. Interesting. You can only be possessed if you believe in possession. Yeah, I'm surprised they even suggested I thought she was gonna have to find this at like an alternative source on her own, but whether they believe it'll work or not, I guess, is another thing. Those are quite the stairs to fall down. Jeez, right, that would hurt. She found a cross under her bed. Now did you? Not me. That's an interesting shot with him being on the stairs, the two of them having the conversation on the stairs, but with different sides and like their different levels. Except your daughter, so how can this be? They think Reagan killed Bert. Doctors never asked what is this fungus we wouldn't today have penicillin, correct? And they found something like what she's holding by the stairs. Like a little animal sculpture or something. Yeah, this police officer thinks that there's something more suspicious with uh, Burke's death. He's asking the priest, like, do you think a priest did this? And now she's thinking that possibly Reagan could have done it. Oh my god. Whoa! Cheese and rice. Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god. She, um, if you've seen this movie, you know just what happened with the cross. Oh my, oh God. <laughs> Cheese and rice. My opinion, mm -hmm. he was killed by a very powerful man. That the deceased was killed and then pushed from your daughter's window. Really? You might ask your daughter if she remembers seeing Mr. Denny's in her room that night. Meh. Now maybe she's thinking like her like little he, he, girl pushed yeah. Denny, uh, Denny's up. No. No! <laughs> So strong. Oh, no, no. Man, this is next level. Oh. Do you know what she did? Oh, Your canting daughter. You know, the movie is not scary, doesn't give you jump scare, but that. No, it's very explicit, man. Yeah. Oh. Whoa. Oh God! What the fuck? What is? What is it? It. What is it? Too strong. Yeah. Stop her! Oh! Oh! No! Oh my oh. God! No! So disturbing! Ah! 
Oh, oh, the door. Oh, shit. That's about. I'll try. Crap. Move. Do you know what she did? Your canting daughter. Holy hell. Oh, my God. I got a bruise. So I should have oh, told yeah. I wouldn't be in uniform. And, uh, how do you go about getting an exorcism? Hmm. I beg your pardon? Well, you just need to fill out this form yeah. here and send it yeah. into the diocese and then... Where is Max Foncito? Yeah, he just disappeared. Working on her last nerve there. As soon as he sees her, he'll, yeah. he'll know that yeah. something's yeah. up. What are we gonna see now? What now? What? Everything, everything's been horrific I need so to far. Wash my eyes. <laughs> Hello, Reagan. Oh. Wow. Where's Reagan? In here with us. Wow, that voice is something oh. else. I'm gonna spit on him or something, or bite him, or what is it? Oh! There's the pea soup. Oh gosh! Don't look! Don't look! Okay, can look. Three, two, one. Okay. Now hear me out. What if she just takes her down to the church, set her down on one of the pews, and just let them witness her? I'm a friend of your mother's. I'd like to help you. You want to loosen the straps? She sounds like a she got it. she's been smoking all her life. Where's Reagan? In here with us. Your mother's in here with his cash. Would you like to leave a message? I see that she gets it. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, mom, will you get out of there? <laughs> I fucking love that. <laughs> I don't think they're down it? for these games. <laughs> <laughs> oh, his mouth is open. <laughs> <laughs> Do you need any more proof? The, the eyes? The voices? The voices alone? I need evidence that the church would accept his signs of possession. Like what? Like her speaking in a language she's never known or studied. What else? Like her eyes changing colors, her voice not matching that of a little girl's. Six months under observation in the best hospital you can find. Yeah, you know, I'd be down with that. I'm telling you that that thing upstairs isn't my daughter. Yes, you are right, but this is bigger than you. I like this father. He's a badass. Look, I'm only against the possibility of doing your daughter more harm than good. Nothing you can do could make it any worse. Not wrong. Did you know my mother died recently? Yes, I did. I'm very sorry. No. Is Reagan aware of it? Not at all. Why'd you ask? It's not important. Good night. It's very important. How do you sleep at night knowing that someone's like just a skinny little handcuff away from slicing and dicing you? What an excellent day for an exorcism. You'd like that? She's so cute. <sighs> Did you do that? Uh. How long are you planning to stay in Reagan? Until she rots and lies stinking in the earth. What's that? Holy water. You keep it away. <gasps> it burns! What an excellent day for an exorcism. But wouldn't that drive you out of Reagan? This movie, guys. Did you do that? Uh, I bet they didn't clean this up. Or... What's that? Holy water. You keep it away. Uh, oh, it burns! Oh! Oh, please! I'm not 
it next to it? Ryan. Hey, look at your fucking shirt. Oh, you know it stink. I would come in there with a bucket of holy water and just be like, yeah, yeah, bitch, yeah. No one there. It's English. That's English in reverse. Give us time, Saturn. Also, she talking backwards. Also, she a red rum motherfucker. <laughs> Shut up. I'll be right there. What's wrong? What is it? Shh. They're not going to tell us what's going on? Why are we still here? We're, the service, why are we here? <laughs> Listen. I can, I can go work at McDonald's. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna be a servant at a place where they got a demonic little girl upstairs. Is he the guy from the poster? I'm assuming he is. Also, can we just mention how ominous is that poster? Ah, it's like the poster. Just what I said as well. Mrs. McNeil. Yes. My father Mary. Father Marakeet. Is he related to Parakeet? <laughs> That's a loud burp. So it is the same guy from Iraq. What a great way to integrate that first 10 minutes that I had, like, no idea why they included. Don't let anyone decide for you. Just like, shut up. I'm trying to listen to a podcast. Make sure to take the holy water into that room, please. It's the only thing that seems to work currently. What is your daughter's middle name, Mrs. McNeil? Teresa. He's trying to comfort her before he goes in and exercises the shit out of her. This is gonna get fucked, isn't it? This is gonna get messed up. Get your cock up her ass, you motherfucking worthless cocksucker. Yep. If anything, this movie is a great metaphor of how feral a preteen can be. You know, they're just learning about swear words and everything like that. What the fuck is she doing with her tongue? In the face of the enemy. <sighs> Let the enemy have no power over her. And the sound of the liquid be power is to harm her. Your mother sucks cocks in hell, Lord, Paris, you faithless slime. Lord, come on to me. The Lord be with you. How is this coming out of a child? Who sent your only begotten son into the world to crush that roaring lion. Hasten to our call for help. And uh, snatch from move out of the way, the bed's moving. Reagan Therese McNeil. Ah! So he may no longer... What a conveying fucking performance by this little girl. Oh my God. I'm so tense right now. Oh shit. Oh, this is gonna be intense, isn't it? Guys, how much time do we have left? Can this be almost over? Okay, 25 minutes. <gasps> this might work. <laughs> I'm so scared. Oh my god. Oh. This guy's a professional. Your mother sucks cocks in hell, oh, Karis, you faithless swine. Oh god, don't listen, Karis. Don't listen. Amen. Amen. <gasps> Father Karras. Come on, Father Karras. Come on. David, the response, please, Jason. Say it! Oh, Jesus. Let oh, Jesus. Cry. Come on to me. Send the power to confront this cruel demon. How did, oh, how did they get her tongue to look like that? It was pointy. Holy moly. See oh. the cross of the Lord. If God knew our oh, oh the green vomit. Linda Blair is doing such a good job. <coughs> oh, no. oh no. I cast you out, unclean spirit. Show it up your ass. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. It is he who commands you. The house is splitting apart. Christ. No, 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 I didn't want to see this again. No, 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 I specifically asked to not see this again. I specifically asked. Amen! Amen! By the judge of the living and the dead, to depart from the servant of God, the power of Christ. That the power of Christ compels you. Oh, my God. Nothing's happening. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh my god, it's coming back down. 
oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, this is, this, this is like, this is so suspenseful. This is so suspenseful. This is taking forever! This is the longest, I guess I've never witnessed an exorcist, but this is terrifying. This devil really wants to stay in her body. It's pretty messed up. Also, Marin looks like he's about to keel over and die. He is so pale. Is that statue like a representation of the devil in Iraq? I don't know what that is. Holy Lord, Almighty Father, everlasting God, Father of all God, listen to our call for help and snatch from ruination. Oh my God, who is lifting it? Father Karras. Focus! Focus, Father Cass! Don't lose your focus, Father Cass! Damien, the response, please, Damien. Damien! See the cross of the Lord. The power of self power. Yuck! Oh! Oh, man. Still, it's not out. It's not out. Father, what? Oh, no. Jesus Christ! What? Oh. It is he who commands you, who lives and reigns with the Father and the Holy Spirit. Mm. No, what the, what the hell she is doing? Defender of the human race. Ah. Oh. She is trying she's to continue ah. with her, right. And make up a conversation. Mm. Oh, she's tearing it out. No, no, don't let her do that. Depart from the servant of God. No, no. <laughs> I don't oh, my God. Oh my god. It's the power of Christ. The oh power of Christ god. compels you. Leave her. The power of Christ compels you. Leave her, please, leave her. Do not despise what, what, my command. Is she done? Because you know me to be a sinner. What is happening? You're still tying her head. Yeah, they're still tying it. God the Father commands you. Ah! Oh man, we're not going at all. That, 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 that. Please let go. Now Let's what? Rest before we start again. Oh, again. And rest. <laughs> like right now. He's not getting up. Please get get off that place. Yeah. How can you sit there? And you know they say in Africa this took months exorcism. But he is not getting up. How, how can he man? And you know that devil say that you killed your mother. But it can be a lie now. He was warned. He was Still. a before that. Don't you know, listen to the lies. It's about your relatives. You have to take everything seriously. She's still wheezing though. I don't think it's over. Yeah, no. But they're doing some. I think the point is to make us despair. See ourselves as animal and ugly. To reject the possibility that God could love us. Will you excuse me, Damien? Did it go to her because she was like maybe like the weakest around him? So his he was losing his faith and so that made it like... Yeah, but they didn't know each other though. No, but they <sighs> lived next door to the... Didn't they? I don't know. I was also wondering, would this have an effect if he's kind of losing his faith already? It's a cool pill case. <laughs> oh, this one's gonna kill him, isn't it? Is he gonna leave the body and possess him if he loses faith? Mm. Freaking Voldemort's soul. <laughs> Why you do this to me? You're not my mother. The growling. Mm -hmm. She's going to call me. You're not my mother! Get out. Mm. Round two. No. <laughs> Fight. You doing all right there, someone? Yeah. Okay. Is it over? Is she gonna die? No. <sighs> oh, those goddamn stairs. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't even considered that this movie might just not have a happy ending. It doesn't feel like it. Yeah. Yeah, like it's not. Just the fact that like what her body has gone through, I yeah. don't understand how a, the body could survive that. Yeah. Obviously, like the neck twisting and everything and all the things. Oh, dude, you do not want to be here right now. Oh. What the? <laughs> no. He died doing this shit. Wait, what? No. You're trying to bring him back, not freaking send That's him. That's not a chest compression, bro. Back into the freaking underworld, dude. You son of a bitch! 
Oh, <laughs> yo! What the fuck? He's oh going to him right now. Come into me. Oh my god, no. Take me! Take me! Oh no, why would you do that? Of course. Oh my god! Mother. What the fuck? Is this guy gonna come upstairs and ruin me? Nah. What? What? Straight up killed him. Come into me! God damn you! Take me! Dead now. That cut there yeah. to the, from that staircase to the empty staircase. Like life moves on. But what if the car drives away and she just like twists her neck yeah. and like looks at him in the back? <laughs> Imagine. disgusting why i don't know it's just it's just it doesn't you know it doesn't make me want to get sick like everybody says it just my legs are just going Neh. and i want to go in the lobby and not watch it and i have to cover my ears what was it that made that happen just when when she started talking like devil coming out of her <laughs> how about you uh, i can't even describe it it's so horrible it just I don't gonna... know why I waited it four hours to see that. <laughs> the devil made her did it, I bet. The fact that people do wait four hours in line and then go back in to see more after they've fainted or gotten sick, I guess it shows how far some people will go for the thrill of being chilled to the bone. Did you see the part where she turns her head around? Not, not yet. I'm not gonna see it either. <laughs> she, 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 she turned her head around. That bad. Scare me to death. Things just like this just it just scared, really scare me to death. I'm just nervous. Do you remember what particular scene it was that uh, the she was in? What was it? Oh no, no, no. <gasps> what? <laughs> No! Oh! Oh man, this is horrific! Oh, shut the Oh! Oh! Do you know what she did? Please stop this movie, please. I don't want to see it. What the hell was that? Oh god! That was totally horrific. And I thought he, she could have told that man because that man is a friend of this man. Then he could have like... Chris McNeil. Oh, no, no, no. He's... I'm Father Karras. Yes, please. Talk to him. He could help you. Oh, she's... Father's maiden name. Yes. I don't want to see your face here. Please. What is it? Sweating. <laughs> please. Just yeah, stop this movie. Please stop this. Please. <laughs> No, God, is he's not on. Please pause it for a time. No, I can't. Demon. If that's true, I know. then you must know my mother's maiden name. Yes. I don't want to see your face here. Please. What is it? Sweating. <laughs> please. Just stop this movie. Please stop this. Please. No, God, is he's not on. Please pause it for a time. No, I cannot. Please. That's... No. 
I won't be able to sleep alone today. <laughs> oh God, I don't Same want to here. watch this. <laughs> now I know why people suffer heart attacks while watching this movie. Oh God, please. Oh my god. 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 Oh my